Hi guys, I'm Alex. I'm Sean. This is Pop Preview, and we have a Pacific Rim 2 trailer. Guys, I, I'm i so excited. I didn't even know this was happening. I heard that it wasn't going to happen, and then it was, and then it definitely wasn't. And like now, here I am, I'm sitting here, and, and the trailer's right in front of me. Can you tell how excited I am? Well, you can thank China for, for Pacific Rim yeah, 2 that's happening. True. Cause thank you, China. This, if this movie didn't do well in China, this movie was never going to happen. Thank you, China, for everything, except your your climate change bullshit. Just kidding. It's a joke. What? It's a okay. well, you know, they're saying that like it's all a hoax. That China, it's yeah, all yeah, China yeah. making stuff up. It was a Not joke, for this guys. To talk about whatever. I'm just so excited about Pacific Rim too because I Pacific Rim was just one of those movies where I was like, I never seen anything like it in that way that actually made me get excited about a movie. You know, yeah. it's been, it had been a while since I've seen something that actually got me excited. Like, there's been a lot of good movies, but nothing that's just like, oh my god, that was great! And Pacific Rim, Pacific Rim was one of those movies for me where I just, like, totally was just, I loved it. I just loved it. Uh, it was just okay for me. What? It was just okay. Like, the idea of it was like, oh my god, are we really going to see this? But for me, I don't know. It was just... What I loved about it was it just how, the right how, like, anime that it kind of was. Like, oh, they yeah, were drawing part- a lot of, like, you know, there's the, the big robots the, and the Jaegers, and then there's the um, the the kaijus, and, like, the, you know, there's a giant sword, and, like, there's just so many, like, really weird, like, Japanese moments in it. Yeah. And <laughs> it's just, like, this is so great. And there's a lot of humor, and, um, yeah. So, um where did we leave off? Then the last one we left off, they closed the seal, the Pacific Rim yeah. seal, and um, I don't know where they could possibly go from here. I did hear like several years ago that they were going to do like a crossover with Godzilla as as like he was the original kaiju that came through and like yeah. that because I'm a huge Godzilla fan like that made me excited. I don't know if that's going to happen. No, I don't think that's happening. He's anymore. crossing over with King Kong now. <laughs> no one cares about King Kong, you guys. No, I, I do. I want to see that fight. Okay. Even though I think Godzilla's going to win, but that's another Godzilla's story. Godzilla's But bait. Pacific Rim Two, I'm I'm like I said, I'm curious to see where they're going to go with it. Um, the the well, King, because Godzilla thing would have been interesting though. Well, yes, and like sort of on this front, like obviously I'm excited, but there's a part of me that's like, how can you possibly heighten, like what can you do that's different? Like what are they going to do with the Jaegers? You know what I mean? Like are they going to be, maybe they're going to get a mind of their own or something and then like, then there's going to be a giant robot. Like, I don't know. I'm just trying to think of ways, and I haven't seen this yet, and I'm sure this is going to tell us kind of what's going on. Maybe. Um, Here's me just speculating before, you know, moment of truth, but um, hopefully we're going to get something new and different, um, something heightened. I think so. Uh, Gil- Gilmore is not uh, Gilmore del Toro is not doing this one he's just right. producing this one okay well at least he has his fingerprints on it in some way so hmm. we'll see let's watch right. it what is a Jaeger a Jaeger is the pinnacle of human invention when the monsters came we did not wait for heroes to fall from the sky and save us We saved ourselves. Innovation is our superpower. What is a Jaeger? It's you, times a thousand. Tall as a mountain, with a beating heart that burns as bright as the sun. Enabling us all to become the most heroic version of ourselves. Join the Jaeger Uprising. I don't know what that means, but I guess I was right about, you know, them focusing more on the Jaegers. Yeah. Um, because I feel like that just had to be sort of the next step. Either it looks like maybe they're relying on them too much. You know, I, I'm just trying to guess what the the sort of the theme of the story is going to be. Well, I mean, like, this is pretty much just like a recruitment film. Uh, well, yeah. yeah, of course. But, uh, you know, my guess is that they're focusing so much on the Jaegers that there's going to be some kind of, like, you know, they're not going to work anymore. Or we... we we put so much energy into the Jaegers that like other things are falling apart on Earth. Maybe. So I'm really excited and uh, I, w- I wish that I could have seen a kaiju, but yeah. I mean, like, are we our own kaiju? 
Maybe, really? maybe well, maybe are now we? we are. Yeah. And it's curious. I uh, love to see John Boyega in this because yeah. John yeah. Boyega is great, and obviously we're going to see him in The Last Jedi in December. But to see him in other things, or he's going to be great in it, I think. Yeah. No, I'm very excited, and um, I I can't wait for the next one. Hopefully, I get a kaiju. Um, I will say, you know, there there is there was this ominous quality to this video too because we hear the um, the voice, the uh, computerized voice. And it's kind of like not working so well towards the end. They're like it cracks a little bit, and it's kind of like yeah, you know. And it's like ooh, something's malfunctioning. Like I'm just looking into it subtextually, and I just so I got maybe, a little bit of an uncomfortable feeling watching that. So, so it might be like like Skynet kind of thing. Like the the Jaeger starting to turn on the humans. That's like what maybe I'm they get a mind of their own, and it's Jaeger versus Jaeger this time, maybe. Yeah, which I mean. I want there to be kaijus, and if it's just Jaegers, I'm gonna be really sad. But hopefully, it'll, I don't know. Whatever. There's still a well, lot maybe, of maybe they time. reopen the reef, and then then the then they can come out. Well, the kaijus to come and actually destroy all the Jaegers on purpose, and then mankind and, and kaiju live in harmony. And I can have a pet kaiju, right? I don't know. I would want to live in that world where ro- aliens, big ass robots, and stuff are. Could crush my house. I'm sorry, you wouldn't want to live in a world like that? What? <laughs> Where, like, you gonna have to get insurance for kaiju? Kaiju insurance, sure. <laughs> I mean, it's way better than earthquake insurance like we have here in LA. Kaiju insurance, it's great. Anyway, oh, obviously, we could speculate all day, but, um, you know, we didn't get a lot from that, but, you well, know, it's gonna a... focus on the Jaegers. I got a really uneasy feeling about that recruitment video. Yeah. Um, and,. Yeah, so that's this is that's like the guess. definition of a teaser. You, I mean, because they're yeah, they're, they're kind of playing with you a little bit, like oh, Absolutely. like come join the Jaeger team. And guess how many toys they're gonna sell? <laughs> uh, a lot. Yeah, it kind of looked like like Big Hero Six a little bit. Uh, yeah, big yeah, but like way cooler. But and, well, I mean, more serious, but obviously, but yeah. Okay, well, that was fun. What do you guys think is going to happen? Do you think it's going to be um, Jaeger versus Jaeger? Are there going to be I Jaeger so. versus human? Like the pinnacle of human invention? Oh, I don't know. There's so many great little little clues in there about what's yeah. going to happen. So I'd love to hear from you guys. Comment below. And uh, definitely like and subscribe um, so you can check back when we actually get a real trailer. And I'm definitely going to be looking at that ASAP. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned. And until next time, I'm Alex. I'm Sean. Bye. Bye, guys.